Hey guys, just thought that I would do my October's favorite video. Um, I'm going to start off by talking about more of like the beauty product type stuff. Um, this is has been my favorite scent for quite a long time. It's Warm Vanilla Sugar. It's from Bath and Body Works. Um, and as you can see, I it's almost gone. I'm going to need to get some more soon. Um, the next thing would be um, my eye makeup remover by Lancome. Um, this is my second, it's just the mini bottle. I have, right here I have the full size and I also have another mini just like this that I can open soon. Um, next thing would be my Quo or however you pronounce that, um, concealer. Um, it just looks like this. Just like that. Mm. And it, it really blends easy. I use that like underneath my eyes and stuff. Um, as you can see, I have like really bad bags. Um, next thing was the Falsies Volume Express by Maybelline. This is going to be in one of my empties videos soon because there's not much left. Um, but yeah, looks like that. And it just really, really, I, I find it elongates my eyelashes and basically does what it says it's supposed to, which makes it look like you have false eyelashes on without actually putting false eyelashes on. So it's pretty awesome. Um, for my lips, I abs I got this last year for Christmas, um, and I use it all the time, so obviously it's going to be in this. I, it's what's on my lips right now, it's Lush's um, Lip Stain in Snow Fairy. It was from the Winter Collection last year. Um, I'm not even going to show you what the inside looks like because it's it's pretty hurting right now. Like, look, look at that. that I'm going to need more of that. Um, but yeah, so it's on my lips right now. Um, and then on top of that, which I use all the time, it's the C.O. Uh, Bigelow in, uh, in the Mintha Lip Shine by Bath & Body Works. That is getting pretty empty too. I use that over top of a lot of my lip stuff. It gives it like a nice minty, um, refreshing feel and nice shine to my lips too. So you can see there. Um, for my nails, I, I live for this one right here. It's called, um, uh, Buffy the Violet Slayer and I shook it up but you can see where the darker line is that's where it sits it's look at my nails I gotta redo them that's horrible but yeah um so I use this all time it's by Wet n Wild it's not very expensive at all um but like look at that color and don't mind my nails I know they're chipped they're pretty bad but looks like that. Um, and the other thing I got, especially for like the month of October, it being Halloween and stuff, I got, um, it came in a trio pack from, I buy it at Winners, um, and it's this green, but it actually glows in the dark. So you like hold it up to the light. Let's see if I can get it to work on camera. You hold it up to the light, like so. You can't see what I'm doing, but I'm holding it up to the light. And then, let me turn off the light. Look at that. And then you just like put it on your nails and your nails glow. And it, but yeah, like, see? There it is, see? Because the screen here is lighting it up, so anything that comes in front of it's gonna look, but yeah, that's. That's how that works. 
and I would just put that, it goes on clear, so I would just put that on top of like anything, um, like anything I have on my nails, and it would go. Um, next thing would be, um, this, this is last year's packaging. I have this one, and then I do have a smaller one. Um, it's the Vanilla Bean, um, Noel from Bath and Body Works, and it smells so sweet. I like, I prefer this scent over the warm vanilla sugar. Um, it's more sweet and more complimentary to me anyway. It's what I prefer. Um, next would be, um, God help me, I cannot pronounce this at all. Um, the least, uh, wattier, I don't know, but it's, it look, I don't know if you can see the writing, but it looks like that. If anyone can help me pronounce it, because I'm totally pronouncing that wrong. Um, but it's, it's a, it's like a makeup primer. It's a makeup base for your eyes. And it's a, the cap's already dirty. But it just looks like that, and you just squeeze a little bit out, and then put it on your eyes. And it works quite a bit. Um, I was having trouble with my Kat Von D, um, Poetica palette. I found like I loved the purples in it, but I found when I put it on my eyes, it the color wasn't as vibrant as it is in the palette. So when I use that, it definitely does work. Um, next, uh, this is my go-to all the time, everyday palette. Um, it's my Kat Von. I always push the button. Um, Kat Von D in Saint. And it looks like that. And I use this all the time. Um, also, couldn't be a October's favorite without having some Halloween inspired makeup. So I did a vampire, not vampire, a zombie look. And I absolutely loved this gel blood. When I, I used a makeup sponge and I would like pat it down and the way and like around my lips and stuff and the way that it would form, it actually really looked like clotting blood. Um, next would be, um, I finished up the candle. So it's a candle and it's hot buttered rum and I actually just took apart like the, cause in the candles they leave like that much of the wax and it still smells really good and I have one of the wax melters so I just chipped away the wax and I put it in a little bag and I put the sticker on and I used the the glass container to put my uh, my fingernail polishes and stuff in and what I did was I took some crazy glue and I took the cap and I just glued it to the bottom so it matches like my vanity so it's like chrome and then all the colors that I've been using for the fall in there. And last but not least, it was Halloween and of course you need your favorite candy which hopefully nothing falls out but I keep this anywhere I go and this is just lots of candy corn and like the little pumpkins and stuff that tastes like candy corn. Um, so I went to the ball corn and I got like a huge bag of all that type of stuff. Um, a little awkward now. Okay, anyway. Anyway, so yeah, that's just a quick video. Uh, not really quick. I don't even know how long this has been going on for. But uh, yeah. Anyway, if you guys liked the video, make sure you like it. Um, subscribe to my channel. Check out my Instagram. It's SammyJo2481. Um, and if you guys have anything, just leave comments below and I'll try and answer you. Um, and if you have any suggestions of anything or if you can help me with my pronunciations about anything, just leave a comment and say, hey girl, you stupid. Mm -hmm. Okay, anyway. Uh, yeah, till next time. See you later. Bye.